Oh, oh, Foreign Minister Yang Jiechi has called on the international community to make all-round and sound progress in disarmament and multilateral arms control. Yang Jiechi also stressed China's commitment to peaceful development in his address to the 65-nation conference on disarmament. This is, uh, went on on Tuesday in Geneva. Li Xiang tells us more. China's top diplomat says the world should embrace a new security framework based on mutual trust, mutual benefit and equality. He acknowledged the difficulties while stressing that maintaining international strategic stability and promoting world peace and security remain long-term goals. The international community is confronted by an increasing number of security challenges. Terrorism is rampant. Regional hotspot issues remain hard to resolve. The non-proliferation situation is still grim, and there are growing uncertainties as a result of the negative social impact of the international financial crisis and economic recession. Yang Jiechi said the world should work toward a global treaty banning the use of weapons in outer space and aim for a complete ban on nuclear weapons. The minister reiterated China's development is peaceful in nature and will not harm or threaten anyone. He stressed that China will never seek to advance its interests at the expense of others. Yang Jiechi said China is ready to work with others to settle nuclear issues on the Korean Peninsula and in Iran. China calls for a peaceful resolution of the nuclear issue on the Korean Peninsula and the Iranian nuclear issue through dialogue and negotiation, and we have made unremitting efforts toward this goal. The 65-nation conference in Geneva is the world's only multilateral disarmament forum. But it has failed to agree on any pact since passing global treaties banning chemical weapons and underground nuclear tests in the 1990s. 一下 CCTV。